Culver City Rising Homeless Community has a lot of resources to choose from in the area. Youth homelessness is an issue that the Culver City Unified School District focuses on with the different programs. The Backpack for Kids program gives students in need food for the weekend, while the Culver Closet program provides them with clothes and toiletries items. In the cases of just homeless kids who are just don't have a lot of resources and stuff, this is the safest place they can be for the day. The older homeless population is given food for social services agencies, such as the St. Joseph Center in Venice. The center created the Bread and Roses Cafe, offering yeah. to the homeless hot meals and drinks. The whole purpose of it is to provide people who are living on the streets with a, a moment of dignity and respect. And However, because of the affordable housing crisis, CCSDU Homeless Youth Liaison Andrew Sotelo says homeless people cannot move in low-priced apartments even by having poor credit history. Despite housing services offered, there are just not enough shelters available for all the homeless in need in the Culver City area. St. Joseph Center Director Michael Brady says this forces them to move in poor neighborhoods such as South Los Angeles. There are, there are funds and, and, and voucher certificates that, that can help people get into units, but the housing market, the rental market, is so out of touch with what those funds are providing. It's a humanistic thing in my mind. It's like, it's how do we take care of our, of our brothers and sisters? Brady urges Culver City to help the homeless through donations and volunteer work. For Annenberg Media, I'm Sarah Sutu.